Hi, fam. Welcome back. Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm Joe. I'm Dan. We're back with another reaction. It's movie time, and we got one that uh, all you guys wanted. What is this, Dan? We're watching The Naked Gun. Yes. This won our poll, didn't it? Oh, by quite a margin. A huge margin. Thank you very much to everybody that participated. I hope you enjoy. This is a first-timer for me, so I'm looking forward to it. Cheers to you, fam. Enjoy. I say... Wipe out Washington. Convert and spoil three years of good public. <laughs> oh my god. So we got Gorbachev, we got Gaddafi. All of America's enemies in one Yes. Minute. <laughs> no longer willing to fight. Oh. 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 <laughs> Get him. Oh. <laughs> oh no. It came right off. <laughs> 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 well, you really got it out for I told you. What? what the heck is it? What? And don't ever let me catch you guys in America. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Wait, are you just some random cop? Yeah. Look at here, Leslie Nielsen. Show him how it's done. Yeah, please. Oh, yeah, folks. Uh, no alcohol for us. We've been, some of us have been sick over here. That's a good old fashioned IBC cream soda. OJ. Yep. Oh, OJ. no. <laughs> <laughs> is that the OJ that I think it is? Yes, it is. Oh, no. <laughs> Uh, you're off the roads there, buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> this could have been a lot worse, but okay. How's your car fitting through here? Oh no. Well, this is fine. <laughs> sure it is. There he is. I don't believe it. I never thought I'd see him in a movie. You know, this is before all the uh, bad stuff. This completes our first shipment of heroin. 100% pure. Some serious stuff going on. Yeah. Oh. Oops. Oh, that sucks. Cheap wooden doors. <laughs> Please! Throw down your guns! Uh, you're outnumbered. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot! Really? Con! It is, isn't it? <laughs> Kill him. Yeah. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, you can go down any time. Oh, no way. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. All right, this is just insult to injury now. What, what's that doing in there? I don't know. Oh, come on. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Worst unnecessary death ever. Welcome home, Frank. Good work in Beirut. We all heard what you did. Handling the luggage back there. <laughs> That's about right. <laughs> sure, you think I'm a big hero, the man of the hour? Well, well, Frank, they're not here for you. Weird Al Yankovic is on the plane. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's early. <everything. Yeah. laughs> <laughs> Everywhere I look, something reminds me of her. Oh, <laughs> oh she got big ones, doesn't she? Yeah. What about Nordberg? Doctors say he's got a 50 50 chance of living, though there's only a 10% chance of that. What? All right, hold, hold on. <laughs> that math ain't working. Me, Frank, your buddy. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> that should have killed him right there. <laughs> he's still down there. Now, who did this to you? Love you. Drugs. Hey, nurse. Quick, give this man some drugs. Heroin. Nordberg, that's a pretty tall order. Yeah. You're going to have to give me a couple of days on that one. <laughs> Damn. You don't have some of the evidence somewhere? No, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, man. We should be giving this guy heroin. There's no way for a man to die. A parachute not opening. That's a way to die. <laughs> Having a nut spit off by a Laplander. That's the way I Damn. want to die. Damn. No, Lord. who wants to die like that? I don't. As soon as Nordberg is better, oh, he's welcome back at police squad. <laughs> Unless he's a drooling vegetable. But I think that's only common sense. <laughs> really? <laughs> Quit talking, Frank. Photograph. I love you out of Caracas. A Panamanian ship. Venezuela. But okay. <laughs> Lieutenant Frank Drebber. <laughs> okay. Protecting the safety of the Queen is a task... That's gladly accepted by police squad. Or no matter how silly the idea of having a queen might be to us, as Americans... <laughs> I mean, he's got a fair point. Yeah. We did fight the monarchy. This portion of the queen oh, is... Oh, got the mic Did you take the mic off? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no hands? What do you do? Ed and I drove down to the docks where Nordberg had been found floating face down on the water. Oh. In a case where there are... Good eyes. 
good policeman, bright future. <laughs> <laughs> You're familiar with that face? My memory ain't so great. Maybe this will refresh your memory. I don't know, it's still kind of hazy. How about this? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> that worked. I can't tell you that. Well, maybe this will help. <laughs> you don't think I should. Yeah, you still don't think so. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> to push something on one of my boys i swear it so what are you gonna do about it copper well, why should i tell you maybe this will help <laughs> how about now all right i'm going down to ludwig's up <laughs> what the hell <laughs> at least he made 20 bucks out of the deal he did didn't he <laughs> and he got all the information lieutenant the feeling is mutual <laughs> nice uh cuban uh no dutch irish <laughs> Japanese fighting fish valued at over $20,000. That's an expensive fish. They're really jish. The gift from Emperor Hirohito. Unbreakable. Its value is beyond estimation. He'll find a way. <laughs> I'm sure he will. I'm investigating the attempted murder of one of your dock workers. Uh oh. <laughs> he was shot six times. Fortunately, the bullets missed every vital organ. I don't know how. And there is no room in my organization for any type of criminal. Yeah, yeah that was coming. Oh. Do you have any idea what was out there just five years ago? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> to generate ten times the amount of profit per square foot. <gasps> oh. Has this officer, um, what's his name? Uh, Oops. Norbert. <gasps> we'll, uh... <laughs> like he's not going to notice that? <laughs> I'll have my assistant provide you with anything you need. You've been very cooperative. Oh, no. Graceful entrance. <laughs> nice beaver. I just had it stuffed. Let me help you <laughs> What? He has to a beaver. I would totally take that. <laughs> I've heard police work is dangerous. It is. That's why I carry a big gun. Aren't you afraid it might go off accidentally? I used to have that problem. Really? <laughs> How about dinner? I know this little out of the way place that serves great Viking food. Viking food? I'm actually interested. <laughs> Get to know Lieutenant Drebin a little better. Find out what he knows. Yeah, you shouldn't be asking your subordinates to do that. It's a pretty shady boss you got there. Mm hmm. I figured it's time. What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> okay, <bro. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Anybody get a look at the driver? <laughs> it's still <laughs> rolling. <laughs> We're testing that new anti graffiti wall. <laughs> oh, there you go. You know what they're on medicine? <laughs> That's fantastic. Yeah. Boys, <laughs> think up next. Now that you mentioned it. <laughs> Come on. Nice set design. To the casual observer, an ordinary shoe makes quite a handy weapon. And everything a cop Oh, the okay. Swiss Army shoe. The Swiss Army shoe. Yeah. <laughs> That's great, Ted. Each one fires a single pin-sized dart that knocks out your victim for a few minutes. Oh, why? Seriously, it sounded deadly. <laughs> I, I can't see anything. Use your open eye, Frank. <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm sorry, Frank. I'm giving you 24 hours to clear Nordberg. I know where I've seen him before. Cool hand Luke. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But there's even a more ideal assassin. One who doesn't know is an assassin. Oh, sleeper agents. Oh. I must kill Papshmir. Oh my god, well, that's dark. Will that be with cream and sugar, <laughs> sir? All right, there are some serious <laughs> ethical issues with that. <laughs> you think? Yeah. I had 24 hours to come up with something that would clear my good friend's name. Just... You're going to kill somebody one of these days. Maybe you need to go to the optometrist. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be with you when I finish with Mr. Norbert. He was in the boat, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, the doctor was one, too. Jesus. They're everywhere already. It's activated by the watch? Yeah. Where's the police officer who's on guard at that door? Oh, uh, Lieutenant Drebin called and sent him home. Lieutenant Drebin? I must kill Nordberg. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. The irony in the doctor doing this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Get that pillow off your face. Oh, <laughs> oh God! <laughs> that probably killed him right there. <laughs> Rub it in, why don't you? He did. Police squad, follow that car. Oh, let's definitely check your mirror. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> She's a teen driver. Ah. Oh, no. no. I'll never catch that now. 
<laughs> You're learning defensive driving. <laughs> you can't do this with a with a new driver. It's okay. Normally, you would not be going 65 down the wrong way. Of oh. oh. Gently extend your arm. <laughs> extend your middle finger. Teach me right. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh no! Oh, Where did that come from? Yeah, why does he have that on his car? <laughs> That's the end of it, right? Nope. Oh come what on! The hell? <laughs> nice on the missile. Uh -oh. Into a, what? A fireworks place. Nothing to see here. Please disperse. What else could there be to see right now? <laughs> it was almost midnight when I got to my door, but my night was just about to begin. Uh oh. Oh, I thought he was going to come in guns blazing. Shoot <laughs> sure up his own place? Yeah. Okay, whatever. Knock it off. <laughs> Woman left you for a gymnast, huh? You said we should have dinner sometime. Tonight became sometime. Okay. Almost as interesting as the photographs I saw today. I was young. I needed the work. Oh, my what? God. What photographs? Her OF photographs? <laughs> <laughs> this is all happening too fast. The no man ever. She had her music. She'd hung out with the Chicago Mail Chorus and Symphony. Uh-huh. Don't recall her playing <laughs> an instrument. It was on the road 300 days out of I think it was. Uh, uh, yeah, I think she was having an affair. I think she played the trumpet. <laughs> mm. Why did you have to be so wonderful? Maybe we're just two lonely souls who have found each other. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess it was comfortable, Ben. Back to safe sex. So do I. Oh, that's that's real oh, safe. God, <laughs> <laughs> what the? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Ain't nothing getting through that. My good. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to use a stick for that. <laughs> what? Really? I don't think so. Well, they have all kinds of answers, don't they? Yeah. Oh, no. Who walks out of the theater like that? Nobody thinks that movie's funny. <laughs> no. Oh no. <laughs> Close line the other couple. Please wait a minute. <laughs> Not for two. Yes, for two. I'll call you tomorrow. <laughs> so if we uh, leave. <laughs> If we watch Platoon, and that's, yeah. and that's how we lead, is it okay? <laughs> you didn't realize Platoon was a comedy? Yeah. I love how they ended it like yeah. a music video. <laughs> <laughs> bingo. Yep. <laughs> he likes his bingo. Not exactly keeping a low profile here, man. Twenty million deposited on Manny Bank Zurich upon proof of Queen's death. Uh oh, there's a conspiracy. Yep. Oh my God, why are you panicking? <laughs> He's breaking up the whole building, why don't you? He's gonna destroy this place. Maybe not. Oh. Okay. No, you know he's destroying this place. It's gonna burn down anyways. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh Oops. god! Just get out of there. <laughs> You're not helping. You were never here. And here he comes. <laughs> Good <laughs> god! <laughs> The architecture is anatomically correct. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> oh. Oh my God, is it okay to keep this in? Yes. I hope so. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, no. <laughs> that wasn't a statue. Oh, oh no. <laughs> He's double holding. 
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing what he's got to do, man. Oh, oh no! Oh. <laughs> really? Oh no! <laughs> Put it down. Why are you like this? <laughs> Sexual assault with a concrete dildo. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want any more trouble like you had last year on the South Side. When I see five weirdos dressed in togas, stabbing a guy in the middle of the park in full view of a hundred people, I shoot the bastards. That's my policy. <laughs> oh, no. It was a Shakespeare in the park. Oh, no! <laughs> I was on your side there for a moment. You killed five actors. Good ones. Jesus. <laughs> Poor actors. <laughs> he just shot five stage actors. And we'll get our first glimpse of the queen, Ken, as she begins her visit oh. to Los Angeles. Christ. Yeah, don't drink that. I think that Vincent Ludwig is involved in a number of criminal activities. Vincent Ludwig is a well-respected, generous, oh kind man. It's just too bad you don't know. He's deeply frozen in there. <laughs> well, woes. Are they back in business? I thought they closed down three years ago. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. He wants you to meet him at the 7th Street Stockyards. But you promise me that you'll be careful. Of course I will, funny face. Sounds like a setup. I think so. Are you sure you won't have something to eat? You don't have anything oh. to eat. Oh, is there a cockroach carrying that out? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> you disgusting slob. Hey, man, I have a message for you from Vincent Ludwig. Dig, dig, you're I'm sorry I can't hear you. <laughs> don't Come fire on. the gun while you're talking. He's trying to kill you. Okay. He has a lousy shot. Oh, no. What, what's toxic waste doing in this slaughterhouse? <laughs> That's bullshit. <laughs> I worked in a slaughterhouse. You're not supposed to have anything like that there. I know, but it's getting all in that broth. Oops. Oh, he's going to turn into the Joker. If he survives. See? <laughs> Just like uh, Michael Keaton's Batman. Yep. Or Tim Burton's. I'm sorry. I think he's dead. They're planning on doing it tonight, Ed. Here. That's why they're trying to knock me off. We'd better be on the lookout. <laughs> <laughs> Easy there. Hey, I didn't all right, do anything. Wrong. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, how about this? Do you think we... Well done. <laughs> Look, Ed, he's got a picture of your wife. Oh, God. <laughs> Ethel. But what are they doing? <laughs> <laughs> Anyone else here seeing his wife? That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't make a scene now. Jesus. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. <laughs> That's some foreshadowing for you. Yeah, for real. Frank. Surprised to see me, Mr. Ludwig? This is not the time or place to talk. The gloves are off. I'm playing hardball, Ludwig. It's 4th and 15, and you're looking at a full-court press. <laughs> what? Uh, that's too many things. Talking about... My stockyard meeting, butter wings. Or don't you remember setting that up? But Mr. Ludwig said you call a meeting off. Pop me another one, schnooky lumps. Schnooky lumps, butter wings, <laughs> good lord. It's true what they say, cops and women don't mix. It's like eating a spoonful of Drano. Sure, it'll oh. clean you out. But it'll leave you hollow inside. <laughs> it's one way to look at it, I guess. I guess. To think I trusted you. Here, you can take this back. Who's is that? <laughs> <laughs> what have you been doing, Frank? By the way, I faked every orgasm. <laughs> How's that even possible yeah. for you? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Generously donated by Mr. Vincent Ludwig. Oh my. Queen Elizabeth II. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> All the ways to do this. <laughs> and now everybody sees you. It's disgusting the way they splash this stuff all over the newspapers. What is journalism coming to? Wait, they keep changing positions. <laughs> what are you doing here? Vincent Ludwig and I, there was never anything between us. He likes East German men. Oh. oh. You were right all along, Frank. Ludwig is planning to have someone assassinate the Queen. Where? At the baseball game. The Queen will be there this afternoon as a guest of Ludwig. She's going to a baseball game? Okay. Yeah. I better get down there right away. This is going to get you back on the force, Frank. We're all right behind you. We're yeah, right behind right. you. Right. You sure you want him back on the force? <laughs> <laughs> I say you're probably better off with that. Yeah. Oh, they pulled out all the stops. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Somebody's taking their seats. 
Put those butts out and get out of here. Slobs. Need better security. Pretty bad, yeah. Yes, Mr. Palacio? Si. I am the head usher. Ah, I'm here to sell. Excuse me. <laughs> well, that worked. Okay, well, I guess you figured out a way to get out there. Please welcome internationally renowned opera star Enrico Palazzo. I uh, think so. <laughs> Can you even sing opera? Mr. Palazzo will now sing our national anthem. <laughs> Do you even know the national anthem? I hope he does. What's so proudly <laughs> Well, he knows it. <laughs> Frank? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Not even trying to hide it. <laughs> <laughs> it's tone deaf. And we still had a flag. <laughs> Merca. <laughs> oh, they should play that before every ball game. Oh god. <laughs> This is what we show up to baseball games for. This? Really? No. Hey, that worked, actually. What? Oh, come on. That happens all the time, man. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, no. You walked in at the wrong time, pal. <laughs> oh, no. That just looks wrong. Oh! Oh, oh no! no. I haven't seen that one before. Oh, oh no! Oh, wow. <laughs> That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> Goddamn head kick right off. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh, oh, it's his henchman from the meatpacking place. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> we going to do this today. Do what? Oh, uh, play ball. They see some idea how the rules work. Yeah. Al, it's Frank. He brought Al. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you ball players, I swear to God. They're spitting and grabbing their yes. coats. <laughs> oh, the wives, too. Gross. Oh. Oh. Uh. All right, let's see if that uniform's on straight. A little tight in the crotch. Uh, can you tell if somebody's carrying a gun or not? <laughs> okay, play ball. You don't need to touch players to find that out. No. Oh. <laughs> you earned that. play go on now strike good job <laughs> it was over the plate <laughs> hadn't even made it over the plate yet. <laughs> say you're too early <laughs> oh whatever anybody can do that on sand <laughs> <laughs> all right joe let's see i don't have sand <laughs> All right, come on. It's the most entertaining game ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Why? Knock it off, dude. <laughs> Knock God. it off. <laughs> Jesus. How is nobody suspicious of this guy? Oh, no. He's got sandpaper. <laughs> oh, my God. Do we look guilty as hell? Oh, no. I don't know how you kept that in there, but okay. He's cheating out there. Hell, yeah, he is. <laughs> Really? The bats are court. Everybody's cheating out here. There we go. Queen's loving it. We love it too. She's getting into it. <laughs> oh my god, you're true mariners. I love it. <laughs> Don't let them get that third out. Right in. Come on. <laughs> He hasn't even touched the bag yet. Yeah. Hey, you're not supposed to do that. <laughs> That's just funny. The other ones. I know this is hard to believe, but what the... apparently the umpires have got for showing. He never tagged him with the ball. You idiot. He was out when he ran the base on the base. Oh, yeah. All right, I've had enough. You're out of here. <laughs> you can't throw another up out. <laughs> even the guy running the scoreboard up there says he was out. Hey, we're not looking at this guy. Uh oh. I must kill the queen. Oh, oh a, my god. He was in carrying the weapon. I guess the right fielder! Oh, 
He's, he's gone full robotic over there. <laughs> it's like Robocop walking through the field. Oh, you're, you're the boss. Yeah. Safe. You're you're right. right. Man was safe. <laughs> Man was safe. <laughs> <laughs> How could you do something so vicious? It was easy. Where were you hiding the Mac-10? <laughs> oh, God. She's going to start a brawl now. Oh, my God. Where are you getting the chairs? Oh, God. <laughs> They're going to kill somebody. <laughs> How did he get out? I don't know. <laughs> I must kill the queen. Oh, no. oh, that's too bad. Oh. Well, that worked out in an odd way. It's Enrico Palazzo! Hey, uh, I recognize that dude. Yeah. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Clearly a doll. <laughs> that's not even Ricardo Montalban either, I don't think. Stay where you are, Drummond. He's got a gun. I know. I can, we can all see it. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> What? There you go, you oh, made one. You killed him. No, no, you'll be alright in a couple of minutes. Oh, oh. oh maybe not. Oh. 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 No. Oh. No. Oh. 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 Go USC? I don't know. <laughs> Adding insult to injury here. So horrible. My father went the same way. Your father went the same way? Good lord. Oh no, they keep hitting the button. <laughs> well, she's got one too. I must kill Frank Trevor. Jane, it's me. Yeah. Funny face. Yeah, that's why she, she wants to kill you. And <laughs> they're televising the whole thing. Yeah. I finally found someone I can love. Good, clean love. Without utensils. What? And maybe the problems of two people don't amount to a hill of beans, but this is our hill, and these are our beans. I thought you were going full Casablanca there for a moment. <laughs> I bought something for you. It's an engagement ring. I would have given it to you earlier, but I wanted to wait until we were alone. <laughs> so much for that. Oh, my God. I love you, Jane. Frank. Oh. True love conquered the programming. Yeah. I love you, man. <laughs> Oh, there we go. This little drama to bring everybody together. Oh, look oh, at this. No. Oh, <laughs> if only. Monday morning, we want you back at Police Squad. With a promotion to captain, of course. Oh, and you get the weekend off. Nice. Nordberg! Hiya, buddy. Hey! Doc says I should be on my bean and this good as new in a week. How is that even possible? I don't know. You got shot to shit. Uh oh. Oh, this just isn't your today, man. He won't be back in a week. No. Oh, my God. Oh, man. That was ridiculous. That's why it's the best. I've seen Platoon. <laughs> As have I. I have never <laughs> had that reaction at the end of that movie. <laughs> what are you talking about? Willem Dafoe's slow, dramatic death, you know, is one of the funniest things ever made. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, but that's not what happened at the end of the movie. But still, <laughs> I don't know where you get some of the writing ideas for this, but that's pure genius stuff. That, it's <laughs> actually kind of dark that that's yeah. what you're laughing at. It's dark if you've seen the movie. But well, yeah, like every movie you see about the Vietnam War is like you no know, really dark and gritty, and that's what they find fun. Jesus, I know, right? That was uh, that was great though. It's just weird watching this movie with OJ in it, too. Uh -huh. knowing what happened to him afterwards. Yes, because I'm trying to keep myself locked into the moment, mm -hmm. but my mind immediately goes to that trial. Yeah, you immediately just start seeing that that white SUV out there on the road. Yes, yes. and I see Cochran up there going, "If the glove doesn't fit, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> yeah, don't wear that shit." No, but, <laughs> but still, <laughs> Leslie Nielsen was great. He was. My God. The thing, too, is, you know, after Airplane, we see him do so many of these comedies, too. He did this, he did Spy Hard, he did um, the uh, scary movies. I think it was also Mr. Magoo, wasn't he? He was Mr. Magoo. Yeah. He does really good at that. I don't, I don't know why, but he does. Apparently, before this, I, I don't know if he's, he'd actually done comedy before doing these movies. Mm -hmm. Like Airplane and whatnot. I remember, like, one of the first things I saw him in was uh, Creepshow. Mm -hmm. That wasn't exactly a comedic role for him. That was a pretty dark role for him, actually. So. Right. 
he did really good at that. So he's rangy, which is which is what's incredible. So. And like the first thing I saw him in was Forbidden Planet, which is a sci-fi film. Oh wow! Yeah. I don't even know what that's about, but that's cool. Yeah, that's that's an old. <laughs> yeah, he's got quite a resume. Mm-hmm. Good for him. He's great at comedy, and then like you pointed out, George Kennedy there was in Cool Hand Luke, mm -hmm. won an Academy Award for that. The other guy who said, uh, hey, that's Enrico Palazzo from this stage that I remember him from uh, Pee-wee's Big Adventure. Oh, uh, yeah. He was also in uh, Teen Wolf uh, a couple of times as, uh, I forgot the guy's name, he was, he was like, uh, he, was the, he was the bigger player mm -hmm. on the team. He like, left like liverwurst sandwiches in his locker <laughs> all the time, like gross. <laughs> of course you got I think his name was Chubbs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course you got Ricardo Montalban there being uh, another villain. <laughs> Yeah, I prefer I prefer the con look. I do too. the The curly hair is kind of a weird fit for him, I think. I think it fits a billionaire, but I mean, still, or or tycoon got type of guy. Right. I mean, he he just does so really good at that though. He's he's got a very smart vibe to him. He does. I like it. And to move from a more serious role, from like uh, Wrath of Khan, mm -hmm. to being a villain in a com in a comedy, it's like I wonder I wonder if there's any difference in how you do things. I don't think so. I mean, in in the in our airplane reaction, a lot of people kind of pointed out how a lot of these actors were like serious movie actors, and what makes it so funny is the fact that they're taking it so seriously, even though it's not. Right. And really, he's just being himself. He's not trying to be funny. It's just the things going on around him is funny because of the way he approaches it. Oh yeah. And really, for everybody else too, like even George Kennedy, you know, you don't ever see him let's like give a weird face. He's just being a normal person. That's true, isn't it? And it makes it funny because of how unusual everything is that's going on around him. I'd say he he showed lots of uh, emotion in Cool Hand Luke, mm -hmm. uh, mainly lots of lots of happy and laughing emotion uh, emotions. Right. But yeah, you're you're right. In some it, in most of this, he was just kind of putting on a regular straight resting face. He just feels like a you know a gritty streetwise cop, and yeah, it works. I thought so. Yeah. <laughs> now you got. I thought you, fam. I thought you guys recommended a great movie here. Yeah. Anytime you can lose control laughing. <laughs> You've the, got something good there. The sheer randomness of everything. Yes. The building architecture, this got Ollie and Adam. Like that one guy, like, like the doctor. My God, the poor guy who uh, who got the order to kill the, the guy's partner there. Yeah. He, he, he was driving a car into a gas tank, into a missile truck there where it looked like a HIMAR or whatever, mm -hmm. and then into a fire stand. Just kept going and going and going. Yes. That was great. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything we missed. I feel like we caught a lot of the things there. I probably I, missed some of the people. I guarantee this stuff that we missed because there's, I say there was one of those movies where just one thing after another, after another, after another, like if you sit there to talk and if you take a minute to talk and, and actually discuss what you just saw on the scene, you probably missed something else. But Yeah, right. I don't know. Like I'm trying to remember who who are, who were all the, uh, who were all the bad guys we saw at the beginning. So we saw Arafat and we saw Gorbachev. Uh, we saw Gaddafi. We saw Pat Schmier. Pap Schmier, yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of the one guy was Pol Pot. I don't know. Answer the question, fam. Yes. Who, who all was in that room? Or do you think was in that room? Exactly. We'd love to know how many evil people were in one room for one random L.A. cop to come in and bust <laughs> up in Beirut on his vacation. <laughs> Lousy security. Yeah. One cop infiltrated a meeting of some of the biggest bad guys in the world. Nobody was around to save the queen when the guy showed up with the gun. I know. You'd figure she'd be surrounded by her own, like, Secret Service types. Right. Where's Where's MI5? Seriously. Oh well. Fam, we could go keep going on, but I think we're gonna leave it there for now. Uh, by all means, let us know what you thought. Let us know if there's anything we missed, as we said earlier. We want to hear what you what you have to say about this one, guys. But as always, if you're brand new to this channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing and help us grow. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and hit the bells to receive notifications every time we drop a new one. And should you feel compelled to give us a piece of mind, do so in the comments. While you're at it, take a look at us on our socials. See what we're up to over there, guys. We're on Instagram and TikTok. But until next time, this is Cocktail Flicks. I'm Joe. I'm Dan. And we'll catch you on the flip side. Cheers to you, fam. Cheers to you, Dan. Cheers to you, Joe. Later, guys.